یا فرید رحل زینه آیی ها Hi, my name is Darin Salam uh, and I'm a writer and director from Jordan. Uh, my debut feature called Farha and it's a coming of age film. Everybody asks me, how did you find this story? Because it's based on a true story or, or real events. And I always say that the story found me. I never found it. Uh, it just traveled over the years to reach me. There was a young girl who lived in Palestine in 1948. Her name was Radiya. And her father locked her up in a room to protect her life and the honor of the family. Uh, and she survived this room and made it to Syria. In Syria, she met a young Syrian girl and shared her story with her. And this Syrian girl grew up and got married and had a daughter. And she shared Radiya's story with her daughter. And this daughter happened to Mimi. So I listened to this story when I was young and it stayed with me. I kept thinking of this girl and how she felt in this room. And my mother didn't have answers. So I kept imagining, uh, especially that I was claustrophobic. So I felt with this character and, and I felt that I knew her somehow. So I grew up and I became a filmmaker and I decided that I want to share this story because, because I felt the urge to tell it. And I felt kind of responsible since I felt that I know the, story, the, the character. So I decided to choose the name Farha instead of Radiya. And Farha means joy because I grew up also listening to stories about Palestine from my grandparents and all people who witnessed in Nakba and Palestine before in Nakba. Uh, and they always talked about it as, as if it was the paradise that was stolen from them, uh, the joy that was stolen from them. Uh, they say or claim that it was a land without people for a people without land. And Palestine was a land with people that had sad and happy moments, uh, culture and heritage and, and joy again. So I didn't want to treat Farha as a number uh, of the 700,000 that were forced to leave Palestine in 1948. I wanted to focus on her journey um, in growing or being forced to grow up uh, in this room. So uh, I chose to, to, to make most of the film happen in one room uh, it was a challenge that at really, really attracted me as a director. Um, uh, also, it's more cinematic. Um, so I decided to take this challenge uh, and, and uh, challenge myself and as a writer and a director. And I hope you enjoy it. I'm not going to talk more about the film because uh, I'd like to leave some space for you to experience Farha's journey. Thank you.